Hey everybody, today we're going to look at the Curve Lathe Brush. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Okay, first, before we, before we uh, take a look at Curve Lathe, let's first... Uh, oh, I forgot. Uh, yeah, I know, I forgot. Um, let's switch to a different brush. Control, Shift, cur Clip Curve. Okay, so... Control shift straight line wait let's get out of perspective real quick so now we're looking at the side view control shift okay now that is gone okay now now we can look let's turn perspective back on a little closer at curve lathe okay fancy fancy I'm so excited okay let's turn off activate symmetry real quick and just create a line ta-da has if anybody has has used 3ds max or another um, 3d program you would be aware of the line that you create and then you um, uh, I don't know I'm in uh, La La Land right now because of how cool this is, but then you uh, lathe it, edit editable uh, lathe or something, and uh, then you create. Hope you get a nice um, pot or something, but here you can do it real time. Look how fancy this is. This is a crazy mushroom, probably the one I'm. You know. Uh, just kidding. Um, oh my goodness! That is so fancy! And you can move around and you can observe it from different views and things like that. Wow! Isn't that so cool? It just gets better and better and better. So fancy. If we turned on poly frames right now, it would be fun to see those polys be created out of nothing. You can't do that in other programs. That is so cool. Oh, it's an alien saucer. <laughs> fancy, fancy. Oh, way cool. Okay, um, control Z, control Z, control Z, control Z. Let's turn polyframe off. Control Z, control Z, control Z. Z, Z, okay. Now let's do from a top view, and let's just drag out a simple and then another one. Ah, it's a uh, hot air balloon. And then uh, another little one. Yay! And then another one. And another one. Fancy, let's make this. <gasps> Ooh! Ooh! Mushroom farm! Yeah. Okay. Nice. Okay. That's good. That looks like a mushroom. Okay, then this one. And bring out the end. Let's see. Uh, oh, that is so cool. So, so fancy. I don't know. That is... Um, I don't know, it's like a top spin or something. Then let's make another one and adjust that. Ah, oh, there's a mushroom. And then another one. Adjust that. You just click and drag. It's so cool. Now let's make a really crazy line. Oh, fancy. It's a top spin. Or the beginning of a 007 level. Cool, and you can real time. That is so cool. Fancy, fancy. Everybody should use this brush. I'm going to try and use this brush for every one of my projects. So cool. And then just move on. Ah, fancy. That is really cool. 
And it's another one. When aliens attack. Cool. That is really, really nice. And just click and drag, click and drag. Fancy, fancy. If anybody else likes this brush, please leave a comment and tell me about it. Cause, or tell me your wonderful stories, because I'm sure there are many, many. <gasps> oh, what could I make with this? I don't know. I, I'm, I'm going to stop the video, because I'm, I'm going to go get, get some more caffeine right now. <laughs> or soda. Uh, um, uh, yeah. Okay.